Lay hands on your own body. Now speak to it. Tell it according to the will of God that's enforced through the death, burial, resurrection of Jesus Christ. Tell that sickness to surrender and exit your flesh right now. Break every chain. Break every chain.
stretch forth his hand to the leper. Matthew 8, he said, if you will, you can make me clean. Verse 3. Jesus said, let's get something right. I will be that clean. Every jot and tittle of scripture is anointed. The semicolon in Matthew 8 and 3 gives us a revelation. I will. Is the written will right here? His last will and testament. The word of God. Amen. The prophetic is that on the other side of the semicolon that says, Be thou clean. Sometimes we stand on the written word, the Logos, and we hear him saying, I will, but yet we don't feel any different. So we start wondering at his wonders and question whether or not it's his will. No, it's his will. It's written right here. Hello? It's so good, he said, by my stripes you were. He will. First Peter 2, 24. Somebody shout, that's his last will and testament. And for anybody to preach it any different or change it, is to commit forgery. Come on, somebody. Who gets anybody the right to change his will? But just because it ain't felt, every time we hear it, we think maybe God won't want to do it. No, 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 no. He's already did it. He's not just willing, he's already willed it. But here we are on this side of the semicolon hearing him say, I will, and the leopard was still a leopard. When Jesus told him, I will, the leopard was still a leopard. But somebody shout when the leopard believed the wheel. The hand of Jesus came from the wheel to perform the wheel. And the preceding word of God, according to Matthew 4 and 4, where man lives, where life comes. Come on, when the word is coming to pass, Jesus said, Be thou clean. I'm telling you, if you'll take hold of our will, his prophetic, his thou be clean, will follow it. There's a word that'll precede the word. See, his word's alive. Man shall not live by bread alone, but by the word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Matthew 4 4. Somebody say the preceding word. Here's the written word. I've been preaching it. It's the logos, it's the rhema. It's written. Where's the logos? It's written. Seeing word is the prophetic. It's Jesus seeing the hearer of the word, saying, I believe it. I expect it. And by Holy Ghost, he comes to do it. And because they believe it, I will now stretch forth my hand. So my shot, this word's got a hand. It's the living word. I'll stretch off my hand and say another word. I'll say because of their faith in this word, the will. I'll confirm it with the evidence of it coming to pass. I'll say, be thou clean. I'm telling you, the next 10 to 12 minutes in this room, because I think that's probably all I got left right here in this service. There's a proceeding word coming. Hello? Some of you still hurt. After you've heard what I've preached, you still know that nothing has become different in your flesh. But it's not becoming different. It's already been made different in Calvary. Come on, i got to look back at the cross. Are we going to sing a little bit more? Can we sing even that other song? Go ahead and go. And next... 10 to 12 minutes. I prophesy by the Spirit of the Lord, symptoms are going to completely go from people. Now, when it's gone, don't try to feel for it. Look at your neighbor and say, don't look for it after it's gone. It was gone. Isaiah 59 and 19 said, when the enemy shall come like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against them. Now, a lot of people quote that and they, they think that is something to come. No, that's that's it. Jesus is the sign, the ensign, the standard, the banner that was lifted up. Holy Ghost done lifted up the banner. Holy Ghost done lifted up the standard. Standard means banner or sign. It's already been lifted. Somebody shout, the Holy Ghost done lifted the standard. So let the devil come. When it comes, 
He's defeated. Before he ever come. Before he ever gave you the sickness. Because sickness didn't come from God. Come on, somebody. If it did, come ask him for more of it. It must be a blessing, but it's not. Come on, somebody. Satan spoke Job with sickness. Job 2, 7. Oh, God. Come on, everybody. Hear the Holy Ghost. God's the healer of it. Now, hear the Holy Ghost. Glory to God. The Holy Ghost done lifted up the banner. Somebody shout, Jesus has already been lifted up on the cross. Jesus has already been lifted up out of the grave. Jesus has already been lifted up to the Father, seated at the right hand. Come on, somebody. The Holy Ghost done lifted him up. So the devil ain't losing. He's already lost. He's already been defeated. This disease has already been defeated. Receive in this next 10, 12 minutes. God, I declare it. Lord God, if I be yours, and if I've hurt you, let it become reality. In the next 10 to 12 minutes, here's what I want you to do. Some of you ain't going to know anything's changed. And for example, there's someone here, you're going to have to go home and eat something that you know if you ate. The pain it would cause you. But by faith tonight, you're going to go home and eat. You know that if you eat it, it would trouble you. But some of you, you're going to know it right here tonight. It's going to go. You're going to feel it leaving. You're going to literally feel the warmth of His presence like hot oil coming through. When you do, hear the instruction of the Lord in the next 10, 12 minutes. I need you to respond to that. And I need you to move from where you are and to come just line up across in front of this platform. You, you feel something, you'll feel it going. You'll really feel it. Somebody shout, the woman with this, you look. And Mark 5 felt in her body. She literally felt in her body. She was healing the plague. Somebody shout the thing she had felt so long. She didn't feel it no more. While the word is sung, go ahead and sing this. He's holy, that means he's the God that cannot lie, Titus 1-2. It's about to shout, a holy God can't lie and be holy. He's no lie. He said it, he'll do it. Numbers 23. Holy God.
somebody. You say, well, I, I still feel some of it, but somebody's thinking, well, I don't feel it as bad as I did when I come in. You need to come home. Jaws 
girls think all the time they pop and they hurt. You always did. Matter of fact, I just did that in my pop. Thank you, Holy Ghost. I give you praise. The Holy Ghost said, come from where you are and lift your hands. If you got nothing but someone you struggle sometimes swallowing food, something to do with your softness, Holy Ghost said, come. Stand before my honor and I'll make it good. I'll perfect that which concerns you. Thank you. 
give it to Woman! 